Hey guys, what's going on? Welcome back to LEGO Star Wars 3 The Clone Wars. Last time we did two more chapters, two more missions. They actually are called missions in this game. Uh, we did... Let's see, what did we do? We did, oh yeah, we did both of um, the first the first two Count Dooku missions here. And uh, let's see, Jedi Crash... Hmm, where do we want to go now? Shall we do uh, the first Ventress mission? Let's do the first Ventress mission, shall we? So we'll load this guy up in story mode, like so, and uh, get started along her path. Asajj Ventress. Chapter 1. Okay, so they're chapters and missions. Both are correct in this case. Beautiful world of Christophsis is held under siege by a separatist droid army, hoping to save lives and prevent further destruction. Generals Obi-Wan Kenobi and Anakin Skywalker plant a daring ambush. Turn the tide in their favor. Da 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 da. <laughs> With just a small detachment of clone troopers, you gotta prepare to spring their trap. Ah. Do 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 do. I'll let Star Wars music play because it's awesome. Good old Star Wars. <coughs> Excuse me. I didn't have time to get to the mute button, mute button there. Oh, I think I remembered this one. Ah, yes. I think they see us. Oh, yep, they sure do. Anakin, I think they're going to be on top of you here in a second as well. <laughs> That'd be me, but it would be Five Finger Death Punch instead. I'd be headbanging and everything. <laughs> All right, so I want to try to get super kits in story mode if I can, because I want to get as many gold bricks as fast as humanly possible, because I really want to get some of the cool gold brick uh, things that there are in the game. Uh, or some of the other areas on board the ship, the, the hub ship, so. Be the other stud over there. Oh, please, recording, don't be weird today. <sighs> Just get all these studs here, and uh, just go ahead and cut this open. There we go. Um, looks like I'm going to have to do this thing with the clone trooper, and then Anakin can come over here and get caught up or something. Oh, wait, no. Now I can switch to him. Right, not like LEGO Star Wars 1 where the AI has to do everything. I can do that now because I can switch characters even when I'm standing, or when I'm not standing right next to them. Very nice. No, that's not what I wanted you to do. Let me just get all these studs real quick. How do I shut this off again? Oh, I see. Just bring this down. There we go. That heart. There we go. All right, there we go. That room is cleared out. Let me smash all this stuff as well. As you can see, if you get ten of those, it will unlock a uh, mini kit piece for you. But we are not going to be going for that necessarily. I'm just trying to get a whole bunch of. Uh, I'm just trying to get a bunch of uh, studs for the, the true Jedi. That's all I care about here. Oh look, studs! Yeah, hey, I didn't expect that to actually give me any studs right there, but I'll take it. Um, is there anything else around here I can smash and get some studs? Yes, there is. Oh boy, there's a lot of droids over here. I should do something about them. There we go. Nice. I like that, um, first of all, the blaster bolts are much smaller in this game, so they look more more pointy and, and, and clean, I guess, is the only way I can really describe it. But, um... It, it, it's like, when you watch the movies, they kind of have this, um, this appearance of, like, everything's happening so fast because they're blaster bolts, and you can just see them swinging their lightsabers around like crazy, and then all of a sudden, all the droids behind them are dead, and it's like, what just happened? And it's because of the blaster bolts just are flying so fast, you can't really see it uh, happen very well. But this kind of gives you that same illusion. Um... Just because of how fast they move and how tiny the blaster bolts actually are. So I think that's kind of cool. So can I not, uh... I need to pick one of these guys up and throw them at the top of the thing? Oh boy. Hmm. What about this other one? Okay, no, this one I can just go ahead and lower. 
Oh boy. So, do I need to, uh... Okay, let's get that out of there. I can assemble this into... Oh, never mind. I'm not assembling it into anything. I'm smashing stuff. I like that too. Smashing things is fun. There we go. Now the door is blocked up, and they won't be coming out of there anymore. Let's smash all this stuff here, get some more studs. I really want to try and get Super Kit here. Or True Jedi, I mean. Because I really want... Um, really want as many gold bricks as humanly possible, as quickly as possible. So, I wonder if... Can I put this back in here and do anything with it? No, I guess not. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nothing else to smash in there. Oh, look, a mini kit. Uh, I better not try to go for that. That looks like that looks like one you might want to go for with uh, R2, or you know, an astromech droid that can hover. Oh, look, drinks. Smashy smash. There we go. Ooh, blue stud. Very nice. We are three tenths of the way there through our uh, true Jedi here. So we're we're getting there slowly but surely. Ah, this part. Yeah, I remember this. So, lots of things to smash in here. Bounty hunters such as Cad Bane can use those panels. And now guess what we can do? We can actually take his head and wear it, like this, and then find that panel thing that it was telling us about. There it is. So we can stand on this thing, and... Okay, never mind. I guess... I don't know. I don't know what I did wrong. I just didn't do it fast enough, I guess. Can I have this, please? Yep, gimme, gimme! Stand in front of the thing. What the hell? It's not working! <laughs> I thought I needed to, to basically take his head and then, uh... Basically just take his head and then use that thing. But maybe not? I don't know. Look at this battle up here. Holy crap. And now I'm desperately trying to remember what the heck I need to be doing. I can't seem to get any hearts out of these guys either, so I don't know. Stop doing that, you. Give me your head and let me keep it. Okay. Why is this not working? Hmm. I don't know. Is there one over here? No. I don't know what the heck is... Uh, I'm trying to remember what I got to do here. I guess I can't do that, but I don't know what else I'm supposed to do. Hmm. So, do I need to smash some of this stuff? I need to take his head for something, but I can't remember what. No, that's not gonna work. Uh, I need to smash those. Oh wait, there's a button here. Okay, maybe that's a good start. Is there a button over here? Yeah, there's a button over here. Let's go ahead and close these. I haven't found any hearts yet, but I also haven't been hit again yet. Oh crap, did I just... Nope, okay, I thought I killed Obi-Wan there for a second. It looks like I need to build this thing up. This turret here. Go, 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 go. Oh, I hope the recording is not laggy. There we go. Okay, I've built this now. Ouch. Okay. At least when I died that time, I only lost two, uh... I lost two blue studs at the same time, so it was much more easy to get my money back. Step on the button. Come on. Get back here. There we go. Okay. I can stand on this thing. Try. Can I, like, oh, there we go. Got it. Then I can go over there and get that one. Yes. All right. Now I've destroyed those turrets. Now I might have to do something with the, the robot's head. Oh, yeah. I gotta get up there and activate that, I guess. For some reason. Get out. Go get these studs. Thankfully, they did not um, have their timers going, it looks like, while that cutscene was happening. Oh, boy. Getting. Unless the, this is not the end of the level, this is gonna be a. Pain to get true Jedi on. 
least in story mode where I didn't have a lot of extra options. This can't be the end of the level already. There's no way. Give me that head. Ow! Dang it. No, I want it. Mm. I was present, trying to press B on it, but it wasn't quite working. Die already. Thank you. Can I take this now? Thank you. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. He's chasing me. He's chasing me. B. Got it. <laughs> there we go. Oh, we're leaving them behind. There's a lot of droids for them to try and deal with. Uh... I don't think that's what we were looking for. That's what we were looking for. Hmm. I keep thinking we're on Coruscant, but we're not. Looks quite a bit like Coruscant. Uh, just like the, the really dense urban kind of, you know, feel to it. So, can we move freely using the... Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. So, I gotta pick these up and then put them where they belong. Kind of like this. Put that one over there. And this one goes down there. Now, before I finish all of that, let me go ahead and smash some things here and get some studs. Yep, there we go. Da -da 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 -da. Mine, mine, mine. There we go. Smash, smash, smash. There we go. Gimme, gimme. And there's some things on the other side of the room that I want as well. Yeah, like this. Oh, look, another drink machine. Ooh, good, blue stud. Uh, we need C-3PO for that, so that's not a thing for now. That would be for free play mode when we come back. Come on. Bring that over there. And bring this one over there. All right, here we go. Is this where we see Asajj Ventress for the first time? It is. Hello. Knock a lightsaber out of her hand and then grab it. And now I have two lightsabers, so I assume I need to get up there and try to attack her with these double lightsabers. Yep. She's gonna kick me and take it back. There you go. And she's gonna do it again. Jedi slam. Do this. And one more. One more time here. Gimme, give gimme. Give that and yeah she's gonna take it back and then run away I think oh nope she's gonna push me down the stairs oh that's close and kind of back to this thing which we saw a few times in uh, like a Star Wars one oh that one was close they are a little more aggressive this time than they were in like a Star Wars one though all right what now what are you doing up there Oh, again? Please, I can do this all day long. Yeah, just keep trying. Just keep trying. I'm sure it'll work eventually. You can go to the other side and try it again. Yep, sure are. This is, uh, it's pretty straightforward here. One more time. And maybe she'll run away and we can clear out this room and get all the studs inside. Yep. So we're going to have to cut through that, but uh, in the meantime, we've got some things we can destroy down here. Get some money. The lightsaber animations are really the most noticeable thing that's an improvement in this game. Just the, the attack animations and stuff. It looks so much better here. I can't seem to smash those, or at least... Uh, yeah, not with a lightsaber, I can't. Oh wait, I got that. Can I do it with the other one? Yep. Oh, there we go. Okay, cool. That worked. And I can smash that as well. I just... Thank you. 
<laughs> that yellow stuff was being stubborn. Didn't want to let me pick it up. Gotta smash all these things. Na -na 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 -na. Studs, studs, studs. And I suppose we can go ahead and do like that. Oh, hey, we got like all the stuff at once that time. That was nice. Get our drinks out and smash everything. Oh, wait. Dang it. I assume I have to smash it while the drinks are out if I want to get the blue stud inside. If it even has blue stud. Yes, it did. Oh, two blue studs out of that one. Look at that. Isn't that nice? Can I smash that thing up there? Yes. Oh, look, another blue stud. Well, that's worth going to the other side and doing then. If it's worth that much money, just for smashing that last piece. Yeah. Another blue stud. I'll take that. Alright, let's move up here. I see another one of these things, which I know gives me good money. In the meantime, though, let me smash all of these parts. There we go. So I need to bring down the TV screens, or the monitors, whatever. And, uh, grab all the stuff inside. Ooh, another blue stud! I love blue studs. I think I've said that a couple times, but I just, they're so good. Blue studs are the best thing ever. Smash all those. Ooh, boy, camera. Please, work with me a little bit here. Grab all of these. Uh, we, al we almost have our true Jedi. I think we're going to be able to get it. There's one more thing over here. Yep, yeah, here we go. Ah, there we go. Last thing to smash. Now, let's move forward. Oh, wait. This is well. Okay, now let's move forward. Whoops. Get up here and climb around on this door to cut it open. Hello! Oh, and then the whole thing came down for some reason. Books, huh? You gonna throw some books at me? Man, please. Oh, is this kind of the same thing again? Guess so. Go ahead and kick me and take it away. Give me this. There we go. One more, I think, I assume. No, 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 no. I want to grab the lightsaber. Grab the stinking lightsaber. I can't. Thank you. Nope, she got it again. All right, well. Grab it. There we go. All right, now, you take that back. And run away again. Like you always do. Coward. All right, hang on. Before we go mess with her again, I'm on one heart here. I wish I could get some hearts out of these things, but I guess I'm not going to get that lucky. Smash this guy. We're so close. There we go, true Jedi. Now I'm not worried about studs anymore. Let's go. Let's finish this up. <laughs> Meditating or something there? Uh, I have a feeling, yep, she smashed the floor. I can get up here, right? No, I guess not. Uh, actually, looks like I need to do this. I see, I see. There we go. Well, thank you for allowing me to create a way to get up to you. Yeah. And then, oh, wait. This one, then this one, then up here. Uh, what was that about? Come here, you! Oh boy. Ah! Hello. Oh god, it killed me instantly. I already have my true Jedi, so dying is not a big deal anymore. You can target an object to throw a lightsaber by pressing and hold X. Pressing and holding X. Like that, you mean? Yeah, like that. Give me that back. And, uh, okay. How about we do a little bit of that again? I'm just kind of try and dodge out of the way here while my lightsaber is on its return trip. Alright, let's try that again. Ouch. Let's 
So I assume... Oh yeah, here we go. Let's get on top of this guy. And cut the leg off. And get the other leg as well. There we go. Now, hold on. Do I need to just cut this a little bit here? Or do I need to throw something at it? I don't know. Oh, there we go. Ah, that didn't work. I didn't get, it, I didn't get fast enough. Oh, there we go. I have to cut it a little bit and then just be ready to get on the spot and take the rest of it down. Awesome. Oh boy. Oh boy. This is interesting. You want me to go over there and attack you now? Oh! Oh boy. You land. Ow. Okay, now I'm over here, I guess. Can you throw something at me? I assume. Yep. Ah, that droid got in the way. Speaking of droids, there. Deal with him. Get these droids out of the way, seriously. There we go. Alright, come here. So it looks like destroying 10 super battle droids at this part will uh, basically allow you to get a mini kit, I assume? Okay, nothing happened to that one. There we go. There we go. Now what is our plan for getting off of this thing? Oh, that's our plan. Get on the steps. There we go. How did she survive that? She should not have survived that, and they should have checked to make sure she was dead. <laughs> well, the ambush didn't quite work, but, you know. Didn't go according to plan. But, we did bring down her ship and... and I don't know, hurt her morale a little bit, I guess. We got our true Jedi, which is another gold brick for us. And if we get true Jedi on whatever the next mission is, uh, that'll be ten gold bricks and we get to play around with the fun stuff. Which I'm very excited for. Let's go ahead and I could have, I could have skipped that. Whoops. Oh well. Plus one for the level complete. Oh wait, no, we aren't at six yet. We were only at four. Dang it. Hmm. Well... That sucks. We're we're just a little bit farther behind than I thought we were. I really want to get to 10 gold bricks. We're at 6 now, though, so there, there should be another area for us to actually progress into. So, well, that's not what I wanted. No, no, no. There we go. Uh, if we go down here, I think there's something we can build with 6 gold bricks, isn't there? Pretty sure. Pretty sure we can go around this way. And is it over here? Yes, yeah, it's right here. Let's go ahead and do that. Now we can move through over here. And, uh, what is this? Oh, character creator. Yeah, so this is another thing. So you can basically uh, have it randomly generate characters for you by doing this, basically. Uh, or you can get in and edit them yourself. So basically, you pick what you want to change, like the feet for example, and then you can scroll up and down through and find a whole bunch of options. You can change basically everything, including the weapon. So you can give them a blaster of various sorts, you can give them a lightsaber of various colors, like so, and uh, yeah, cool stuff. Or you can just pick a, a random one, so it'll randomize, 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 randomize. That Wow, that last one ended up looking a lot like Anakin, the cowboy Jedi for some reason. So, you can get some interesting uh, combinations here, as you can see. 
We'll uh, mess with that at another time, because that's really only useful for free play mode, which we haven't been, you know, planning on getting into just yet, so. And now, if we come over here... Ah, I think this is where we can see the uh, mini kits, which in this game assemble character models, not ships. But uh, yeah, this is, appears to be where we can do that. Is this for a mission that we've started? It is. Ah, the Gungan General. Yes, that is for a mission we started. We didn't find any of the mini kits, but we started the mission at least, so um, yeah. And the recording might be weird. Hold on here. Well, the recording appears to be mostly fine, so from what I could tell at least. So I guess we're good. Um, we're gonna uh, look around a little bit more here. What is this for? If I had an astromech droid, I could actually do that. Which I can find. I can go find R2, but I don't, I don't know if I want to spend the time to do that right now. Anyways, this is a neat little room here uh, where you can see all of your minikit progress. So, I really, like I said though, I really want to get to 10 gold bricks ASAP. Because that... I promise you, we get some cool stuff then. So let's go up and do uh, the next General Grievous mission and just hope that it's not an insanely long mission. Hey, I made that jump. I didn't think I was going to. Um, because I don't want the episode to be insanely long, but we will see. I do want to keep progressing as much as I can. So let's hop over here. B button and mission select. Let's go find... Uh, Dead Moon of Antar, General Grievous, Shadow of Malevolence. Oh, I think I remember this mission. I think this is a really cool one. This is also one of the few actual episodes from the show that I still remember reasonably well, just because it, it really stands out, if it's the one that I think it is. So let's see. Ah, yeah, the ship, the Malevolence. That's what I thought it was. This, uh, this can be a very fun mission. Also might take a little bit, so hopefully not too bad, but I want to get my, uh, I want to get my true Jedi, if I can, as well, so that, uh, get them, them nice gold bricks that we need. We're gonna need lots of those things. <clears throat> Alright, here we go. Leading quite a big charge here with Y wings and everything. Jedi's. Multiple Jedi, I guess, is already plural. Charge! Hold down the A button uh, to boost while you're flying. Press Y to dock with a nearby sublight booster. Press A to fly to a new area. Okay, so hopefully this is going to work this time, because uh, what just happened was uh, I stopped the recording to check on it, because it looked like it was lagging. And uh, I'm going to go ahead and just do this while we go here, so you see this mission is done. Um, I recorded this entire mission, commentary and all, about a 17-minute-ish clip. And I uh, come back to edit it to find that uh, it only recorded seven seconds. Seven freaking seconds out of a 17 minute clip. It stopped actually recording after seven seconds and gave no indication of that whatsoever. So I don't even know if this was in the, the part that was good or kept, so I'm just gonna go ahead and leave it in. You can skip ahead a couple seconds if you've already seen this and you don't want to again, but um, yeah, my laptop. Now, now this time it doesn't seem to be the recording's fault. This time it seems to be the laptop's fault. It's just running real slow tonight. So if it's not one thing, it's another thing. And I can't just, you know, record. So, let's see. I don't know if any of this was in. So I, I'm going to leave it just in case. I don't know what, what made it in and what didn't. So, I restarted my laptop and I ended all the tasks that I didn't need going on. So hopefully... It's just, you know, working like it's supposed to. Okay, so, cool mission here. It's gonna take a little bit to redo this again, but... Um, so, you get to fly around in your little starfighter here and blow up stuff and get studs and things. Now, it can be pretty wonky, as you can see. I'm not doing that. It's bouncing me off of the walls. Which is really annoying when you really just want to get these studs here. There you go. 
So, lots of things to destroy here. Um, I think one of the things I was about to demonstrate before I was so rudely interrupted by my stupid recording being uh, dumb was the little thing over here. I forget what it's called. But if we fly back to this, this thing here. I forget what this is called, but you can get inside of it like so, dock with it, and uh, jump down to basically an entire other part of the level, which is pretty cool. So now, out of fear of paranoia, uh, let me go ahead and, or out of paranoia, let me go ahead and do this again here, uh, and just check the recording. Okay, well so far, it looks like it's working, so fingers crossed that it uh, stays that way. There is more, oh my god, there's a lot more delay than usual, whoa, hold on here, really? Come on now, oh wow, okay, there's way more delay than usual, but I mean, it looks like it's uh, working, so hopefully it is, because, well... Otherwise, I don't know. I'm probably just not going to finish dealing with this tonight because I do not have the patience uh, to deal with this anymore. I really, really desperately want to get an Elgato at this point just because this is so horrendously annoying. So what we're doing here is we are trying to activate this little switch that I'm standing next to, this lever. I'm going to pull this, and that turns on a photon... Uh, proton torpedo, protein, pro, uh, I don't know, I don't remember what they what they call it in the movies. Um, generator, <laughs> and uh, a torpedo generator, let's just say. And uh, that will allow us, there we go, to fire some torpedoes at these things. Like this. There we go. Yeah, we're going to need some more here in a minute, but for the time being, we are good to go ahead and uh, keep blowing some stuff up. So let's get some more of those... Studs that we desperately need. I really want the True Jedi. I was not able to get it on the first run through of this. And also, I did get one mini kit, uh, which is kind of a bigger problem because now I can't show you where that was exactly. But um, this is a gold piece here that we can't actually destroy because even though these appear to be firing pretty fast, this is not technically a rapid fire ship. So we don't actually have the rate of fire that we think we do. We think we're firing pretty fast, but it turns out we actually aren't. Alright, let me try to finagle my way through here, get some more of these studs. Oh, come on. Turn around. Get them. Come on, come on. Nope, they're gone. Uh, as you can see, that can be rather annoying, trying to get studs there with this. Pretty sure there is a thing in this game, an extra, called the stud magnet, isn't there? Oh. We don't know yet. Okay, we gotta get the red bricks first. Well, I hope so. I hope I'm not misremembering or getting confused with uh, another one of the games, but basically it's exactly what it sounds like. You can uh, pick up studs from much farther away, which is so, so nice. How many more of these things do we have to destroy? Just uh, two more of the big circular things. Then we have this little guy down. Whoops, I didn't even do anything. I'd Stop it! All right, there. If you double tap the stick in a certain direction, you can do like a little trick. I don't know if I can like go slower. I don't think I can go slower. I think it's basically one speed all the time. Which is just ludicrously fast in this thing, at least. Plo Koon's Jedi Starfighter here. And of course, you just kind of bounce off of everything. Like everything has a trampoline strapped onto the sides of it. That's what it starts to feel like. So let's let the studs fall out and then try to get a good lineup on them. And fail miserably. There we go. Alright. Now, I've got my torpedoes. I'm about to die, which is a problem. Where's my little thingy? My jump through thingy. Here we go. Let's get back in this. Point upwards. Launch. And we are going to launch a one torpedo. Two torpedoes. And wait for it. Three torpedoes. And that... There we go, we'll open up a big part of the ship here, blow up a big hole in the side. If this isn't recording right now, I'm not doing it again. I don't have time for that tonight. I might not even record the Far Cry episode, which will really suck. I, I really, I really want to make videos, but this program is making it next to impossible to actually do without it being just incredibly frustrating. I need an Elgato, but I can't afford it. Just like that guitar that I want that I can't afford, and a lot of things that I want that I can't afford. 
Ugh. Life sucks sometimes when you can't. When you don't have money. You can't get nice things. I'm not even asking for like nice things. It's just like I just want something that works and is functional. You know, when you spend the money on it. Like this hoppage capture, I think, was like a hundred and something dollars when I got it. You know? When you pay that kind of money for something, you kinda just expect it to sorta, you know, do its job. Not a hard concept. And you can see there, I flew through those, but it didn't actually give me the studs, which is weird. And we try to, there we go. And what about that last one that was there? Can't, yep, there we go, finally. I'm on one heart here, which means I'm probably gonna die pretty soon. So what I'm trying to, all right, there it is. At least I got all my studs back because I was careful enough not to move when I respawned. There we go. Yep. Hey, there we go. That was a nice little run there. So it looks like 100,000 is the halfway point for studs in this mission. Or almost the halfway point. That's not what I wanted you to do, but you know what? Worked out in the end. So, what we have to do here is go and turn on this proton torpedo generator again. Just like we did down below. But we're going to have a bunch of droids that are trying to be jerks and shoot at us the entire time. Like that guy. And I think there's gonna be some more down here. Let's go ahead and pull the lever though, before they show up. Oh, please tell me it's recording. I really hope it is. I hope so, because I don't want to do this again. I don't have time to do this again. I got stuff to do. Good news, bad news situation. Uh, I had two exams this week. I had one today. Well, as you're watching this, it's Tuesday that I had one exam. I have another exam Wednesday, so that's the bad news. The good news is that means I have a lot less homework this week. Which means tonight, as I'm sitting here recording this, I actually don't have a lot of homework to do. Which means I could, in theory, stay up a little bit later trying to do this, but I really just don't... I don't want to. Like, I, I, I want to record and make videos and stuff, but I don't want to deal with this nonsense the whole time. I genuinely enjoy making these videos when things work like they're supposed to. Unfortunately, that's becoming more and more rare, which is really terribly annoying. Uh, is there anything else in here I can destroy and get some more studs? I don't think so. I'm just trying to scrape together my true Jedi here as much as I can. So, um, I don't see any turrets there. Let's go ahead and boost. I keep forgetting I actually can boost and move faster. That recording looks really, really good what I'm actually doing. Like by a good 20 seconds at least. Concerning. It's not what I wanted to do. Oh, now it looks like it's lagging. Oh, please. Oh, please, come on. If you're watching this and there's not an episode of Far Cry up today, you know why. Uh, because this nonsense. So don't be surprised if there is not an episode of Far Cry up today. Sorry, but I, I cannot, I don't have the patience to deal with this. I really don't. I hope I can make a Far Cry episode. If not, well, you know what happened. Why can't I destroy this Dion right here? This is, this is getting old here. I want to just destroy the turret, okay? Is that, is that so much to ask? And I just blow up the gun. Why not? I don't understand. Uh, blow that one up there. And let me try to go over to this other side here and blow these guys up. So I can get some more studs, hopefully. Please, I mean, I'm not doing anything! Ah, why are you doing the stupid barrel rolls? Or the flips, I mean. Stop doing that! I'm not doing anything. To imply that I want you to do that. At all. I can't even blow up these turrets? Why? Do that? No, well, that's not what I intended there, but whatever. Alright, another big area for us to go around and explore. Now can I blow up the turrets? Are they, like, more exposed now or something than they were before? Yeah, I guess so. And I still missed a lot of the blue studs, and I still missed them. There we go. Oh, well, no, there was not one over there. I think there was two back here. Right, yep, two there. Anything at the very nose of the ship? Be a mini kit or something? Nope, 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 nope. Don't kill me. Don't kill me. Alright. 
Well. There. Let's try to just kind of inch my way forward. Ah, that's better. Get all of these studs here. The blues in particular. There we go. Now I gotta destroy this thing. Break down this little ray shield so I can get at the torpedo generator. Yeah, there is there is no going slow, even with an analog stick being very gentle on the stick. There is there is no slow in these things. So let's see, I can get those studs and those studs and some of those studs. I see, I went for like right through a lot of those, and it still just wouldn't give me give me anything for them. It's really annoying. Come on, come on. Almost as annoying as the recording being stupid, but you know. That's neither here nor there. Blow that up, and oh look, I see another blue stud there. And another one there. Alright. Now, I'll launch a torpedo there. And there. And I'll show you how I got the mini kit that I got. Just for the sake of, you know, showing how to get it on camera. Since I can't actually get it again, but... Basically what I did was I came over here. Once you land at this particular spot, deal with the droids so you don't die. <sighs> Maybe. If you can get lucky enough to hit them. There we go. Now, what you're going to do is you're going to take these garbage cans and set them over here and let the machine do its work. And while that's happening, you just defend yourself, kill some droids, have some fun with it. When that one is done, you go and you put another one on there. Now, when that one's done... Oh, come on. You're gonna go ahead and put a third on there. And darn these notifications. Seriously? Seriously? Wait, am I on? Hold on. Which account am I signed into right now? I'm in the right account. Alright, that's weird. I had the red background like it was for my other account. Huh. I don't know. Blue stud. So that's where you would normally get the mini kit. I guess that time it gave me a blue stud. Uh, recording. I hope you're fine. Because I, 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 I'm so out of patience tonight or stuff like that. So there should be some more things for me to destroy here and get some studs out of, in theory. Hopefully. Like these here. Yeah, come on. I just, I can't, look, I can't actually get back in there. It just deflects me away. I, I physically cannot get back there. Thank you, game, for that. Oh, look, I got that blue stud at least. Alright, so it looks like we're gonna get 90 something percent of our of our true Jedi there. Which sucks. Should be able to do better than that, but uh, you know, a lot of the blue studs are being stubborn. I really wish I just had the stud magnet thing, you know? Oh, here we go. Yep. A couple more blue studs. Oh, we're so close. I wish you'd give me an exact percentage so I knew how like how close we were to getting it, but uh, I bet if I landed and did some stuff, I could probably get the last bunch of studs that I need, but uh, we'll get it another time, I suppose. Oh, something I mentioned uh, the possibility of doing was actually um, off-camera, just doing a story mission, <clears throat> replaying a story mission in story mode, just for the express purpose of trying to get another true Jedi so I can get one more gold brick, but I don't know if I should leave that on-camera or off-camera, so I will... Uh, Leave that up to you guys to decide. But that would at least let us get to that 10 gold brick, you know, threshold sooner to get that cool door open. Alright, there we go. Level complete. Hopefully the recording is still going. Please. <sighs> and, you know, again, if, if you don't see a Far Cry episode today, uh, that's why. You know why. It's it's the recording. Or or my laptop, either way. I mean... Whichever is the cause of the problem, it doesn't matter, because either way, the recording is having issues. Whether it's the program or the laptop, so... Yeah, we'll skip that. So that explains why I have a lot of extra studs and, and one mini kit piece there. So... Ah, let's continue. We are at 7 out of 10 gold bricks. or Well, 7 out of 130, but I really want the 10. I promise you, it's worth it when you get to the 10. It's so cool. You, so many things open up when you get to the 10. Unless there's a recording still going for the Star Wars 3. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you have enjoyed. And as always, I hope to see you all.